the third preparative method of carbonyl compounds that is from from all kinds from all kinds in that the first one is reductive ozonolysis reductive ozonolysis reductive ozonolysis now c triple bond c when react with o3 in presence of zinc and water to form a dicarbonyl compound double bond o like this for example ch3 c triple bond h this is known as propyne when propyne react with o3 in presence of zinc and water zinc and water to form ch3 c double bond o the last carbon converts into aldehyde known as methyl glyoxal methyl glyoxal methyl glyoxal next one ch3 c triple bond c react with o3 molecule in presence of zinc and water to form dimethyl glyoxal dimethyl glyoxal okay this is a the next b is b is hydration hydration of alkynes hydration of alkynes c triple bond c react with water in presence of dilute sulfuric acid dilute sulfuric acid and mercuric sulfate as a catalyst now hydrogen double bond here is what oh this is known as enol generally enols are unstable so these are converts into ketones so this particular process is known as tautomerization what is this tautomerization tautomerism now here is hydrogen here is also hydrogen then double bond o like this this is the hydration of alkynes so now i will give some specific examples which is related to the to the preparation of carbonyl compounds from alkynes for example ch3 c triple bond here is h when propyne react with water in presence of dilute sulfuric acid and mercuric sulfate to form here is oh because marconi cuff product is formed then hydrogen it is h then enolization this enol converts into which one ketone so therefore it converts into ch3 c double bond o ch3 when ph c triple bond h reacts with water 
in presence of hydrochloric acid then mercury chloride as a catalyst ph oh double bond ch2 then it involved in enolization the enol converts into which one ketone that is tautomerization double bond o it is what ch3 known as estophenone known as which one estophenone okay this is from alkynes next one from alkyl halides fourth method from alkyl halides alkyl halides okay when an alkyl halide when an alkyl halide reacts with dimethyl dimethyl sulfoxide dimethyl sulfoxide this is known as dimethyl sulfoxide dmso dimethyl sulfoxide dimethyl sulfoxide followed by heating it is converts into aldehyde converts into which one aldehyde for example ethyl chloride react with dmso dmso means dimethyl sulfoxide followed by heating it is converts into ch3 c double bond oh c double bond o h then there's a first reaction then the second type of reaction is oxidation oxidation when alkyl chloride oxidized in presence of copper nitrate or r lead nitrate to form aldehydes to form which one aldehydes for example ethyl chloride oxidized with copper nitrate or r lead nitrate lead nitrate to form to form which one estaldehyde what is this estaldehyde so these are the preparative methods from alkyl halides the next one is next one is from alcohols from alcohols okay first one an alcohol reacts with a mild oxidizing agent like potassium dichromate in presence of acid medium it converts into which one aldehyde 
a secondary alcohol earlier i was discussed a secondary alcohol react with potassium dichromate in presence of acid medium to form ketone to form which one ketone okay next one with uh, copper at 300 degree centigrade primary alcohol react with copper at 300 degree centigrade this is 1 degree alcohol always converts into aldehyde always converts into which one aldehyde then 2 degree alcohol OHR copper at 300 degree centigrade it converts into which one ketone this is aldehyde it is which one ketone ketone then an alcohol react a 3 degree alcohol this is 3 degree alcohol a 3 degree alcohol oxidized copper at high temperature like 300 degree centigrade instead of aldehyde and ketone it forms alkene it forms which one alkene double bond it is what ch2 okay so these are the oxidative methods of which one alcohols